good wonderful morning everybody we're only going for a short walk today well fairly short we're taking the long way around because we're going up and down and up and down streets you probably know what I mean you go down one street go along the main road and back up the next street and then you go down a little bit further and down the next street down a little bit further and up the next street so I'm doing zigzags to get to the playing fields looks like they had training on this weekend and they're doing some works over here and some noise One of the few times that we've actually been out when it's sunny, when it's light. So we can't often do that. And the only reason we can is because we're at Centenary Heights. Because it's a uh, lot better area where we live than what it is in town or heading towards town, it's further, closer to town and the further west you go so it's not just in town, it's west as well if you keep on going west, the worse Toowoomba gets until it gets really really bad which is a real shame because uh, it's an area that I would be interested in moving to because they're uh, you can still get uh, houses on acreage quite easily there and they're reasonably priced not much more than what uh, my house would sell for probably an extra hundred thousand dollars on top that will get me a house in the same sort of condition Where's she going? Where are you sniffing at? You, I just walked through the, all these trees and she like you walk through the trees again. Oh dear. She should be like that. I sniff stuff. Uh. Yeah, and the further west you go, the flatter it is as well. So we're on the on the range and in the hills the further west that way you go the flatter it gets but as I say the further west you go the uh, worse the area is laptop bag Nothing in it. Power cable. That's in it. <laughs> that's interesting. There's a book over there. I wonder if that's related. Let's check out this bag because I might have to ring the police. Yeah, so I did check out that laptop bag. There uh, is a water usage on there. No name, just an address and it's from Logan which is halfway between Brisbane and the Gold Coast so I'll say what's happened and the pad looks like it's got it's a playbook so there's got uh, different plays written on it so I think what's happened is that the guy whoever was using it chucked the laptop had the laptop in the boot or something like that had the uh, bag on the roof and has driven off home to Logan now where is Logan? it's about two and a half hours away yeah so I don't think it was stolen it was open 
the only thing that was in it was a small a short extension cord which is only about a six foot long extension cord and the power supply uh, Hewlett Packard it looked like very generic and that was it so no point in reporting it because it's it's just a lost bag somebody might find a use for it so I've just left it where it was don't worry I am wearing gloves so I, I could go through it the last time I found laptops I found three laptops and uh, I had no gloves on so I wasn't going to touch it I just got in touch with the police and the uh, police went out to claim the bag because it had needles in it and all that sort of stuff and they couldn't find the bag and they rang me up where is the bag and I said well we told them where it was and this was uh, nine days later they went out of course it's going to be gone in nine days nobody's going to leave laptops lying around for, for a week nobody's going to leave laptops lying around for 24 hours of course they're going to be gone somebody's going to take them whether they're stolen or not so total point of waste of time and I said what about all the needles and I said why, why did it take you so long out to get out there and they said oh well we don't worry about needles that's a council problem I said, if you have find no needles again, just ring the council. I was thinking, well, there you go. The council probably wouldn't have touched it because it's stolen goods, potentially. So, anyway, leave you to it, everybody. We're on our way back home. I don't think she knows it yet. <laughs>